You take somebody, you slam them physically to the ground, you put a logo on identifying them. That's what fascists did in the 30s to people. This is not something, Ben, that you laugh about and say, oh, ho, ho, it's only seven seconds. What a funny thing. Get a sense of humor. Yuck it up. It's no, David, not. You're not but, saying we're anywhere is, near fascism, are you? This is, this, David, with all, with all due respect, as a media critic, have you ever had this type of intensity towards people? That, uh, great example, Saturday Night Live. Or would you say that that's humor and funny? You Listen, I denounced I things. denounced Barack Obama when he cut tried to cut Fox from the herd and say I'm going to define what a legitimate news organization that's, that's, is. That's, that's, ask that's Brian. I was I on this show with the same intensity. This is about what Carl Bernstein's talking about. This is about our constitutional government. It's about the high end of the press, which Trump doesn't understand. He knows the bottom feeders in the tabloid world. That's the kind of people he knows. People who can be bought and sold. People who can be scared. If he thinks the New York Times or the Washington Post or CNN is going to be scared by him, he is in for the rudest so, so let, 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 let's be clear about this. What you're saying is, is that anyone else out there that wants to be funny, Saturday Night Live, comedians, people that mock him on TV, that is acceptable. But for the president to have a little bit of a sense of humor this morning no. and to actually put out a video that he was in with fake wrestling, you're now saying is fascism. No, not true, Ben. Me? Ben, when Kathy Griffin did something physical that would possibly incite violence against the president, we all denounced her.